Oh, what's up, guys? Today I am showing you how I clean my room, as you can see, it's a mess right now. But I'm just gonna show you how like, I fold my clothes and like how I hang them up, especially jumpers, because a lot of people have been asking me with jumpers that have hoodies. Um, So, what I do with just like jumpers like that, I make sure I can see like the pattern on the inside. Right. So, make sure I can see that. And then I just grab a random coat hanger. And if you have one of these bits, you want to hold it tight like that and click on where you were holding it. Just like that. It's okay if it's a bit scratchy. It's just like, yeah. And just hang it up. But for jumpers that have a hoodie what I make sure I do is you won't be able to see it on this one but um I will show you on this one I have here so what I do is because this one has a hoodie I um through so it's like that which that's a pattern I try find the bit that's sewed and I fold the hoodie back so it looks like there's no hoodie but then it's just there I fold the hoodie back and I put the um coat hanger on that bit because I have like the clamp coat hangers so that's what I do and it makes it makes it easier for me just so I don't have to um try find the perfect spot to hang uh to put the coat hanger and done and then with ones you can't really see just like this one you can't see the sewing what i do or we'll say you have fluffy ones i just move all the fluff oh and i found it right there, you won't be able to see it, but it's right there. And I just do it from this. And it's just like that. Sorry, I haven't been posting. I've just been really busy with like my family and all that. So. Got one clamper on, putting the other one on. And I've done two, and now I go hang them up. So you have a zip up one um, that's not really, uh, that doesn't have a hoodie. What I do is to make it easier for me, I zip it up. I zip it up nearly all the way, I just leave that much. And then with the collar, you can see I fold that back and you can see just like that there you put the clamper on there but you have to hold these ones because 
is going to just pop back up. Done. These for t-shirts are kind of do a different one. I grab um one of these ones. Um, because these ones will stay on. I do have a little life hack that my, either, yeah, my mum taught me. For singlet tops, all you have to do to hang them up since they might fall is, so I'll show you one that I've already done. Is I use... These ones for like single tops and dresses because I do that. So what you do is easy. You grab two, both of the straps, put that one over the other, and grab this bit, the hook, to pop it over like that. And I do that to my dresses and single tops. So. And um, I like to keep it in order so mine goes like dress, dresses, mine goes dresses, and then play suits, and then singlet tops, and then jumpers, and yeah. It's how mine goes. So that's a little life hack that you can do if your single tops keeps falling off in your wardrobe or American closet. And then, um, so I have okay, I've a dress, a lace suit, single tops. For the jumpers, I'm adding a top. So I have dresses, single, uh, dresses, play suits, singlet tops, and jumpers. Uh, plus, dresses, play suits, singlet tops, tops, and jumpers. Um. Okay, I have to, I'll, I'll be back for part two, I can't film for long, sorry.